Okay, so. <laughs> I already know. Y'all gonna hit me with the. No, I'm not gonna say nothing crazy. So you good. tweeted out not too long ago that you um, started hit or created hip hop or what exactly was the tweet about? Everyone basically misconstrued my words. You know what I'm saying? Basically, what I was saying was I basically helped create a lot of the culture early on. You know what I mean? I was a record executive. I was a DJ. You know, I was in movies and everything else. Ice T's my godfather. You know, it's like, come on, man. Like, most once I realized most of the haters were like 19, 17, 18 years old. I'm like. Y'all wasn't even born when I was putting in work, you know. Right, they didn't even when I was know when I was working with Pac, when I was running with Dre, when I was you know doing Jay Z's album, you know, when I was working with Master P, like y'all wasn't even born yet. So like, it was ridiculous to even have the conversation. So I just let it go. Again, I was venting at some kids over a hairstyle, and it was like the last racist person there is on the per on, on the earth, you know, like. Yeah. It the the, the, it, the internet went crazy when you when they were like going all over. So, um, did you ever design any pieces for Pac or the crew or anything like that? Nah, I was I was in the music business then. You know what I'm saying? So I wasn't even in jewelry then. I didn't get in the jewelry till 2005. You know, so Pac been there. You know, almost 10 years. So it was like, um, you know, I was wearing jewelry then, okay. but you know, a lot of inspiration came from that era. You know, that was my favorite era. You know. Okay, so if you can name one of your all-time favorite Tupac songs, what would it be? So many tears, no matter what, that's what it is. And what relates to you from, from that song? I mean, one, the intro of the song, as soon as you hear boom, 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 I just want to commit crimes and hurt innocent, like, I just get pumped up. Like, you hear yeah. that beat, you know? And I remember, I'll never forget, like, you know, at that time when that song had come out, I had people that were working the record, and it was, you know, just, it was a lot of just, just the, the Stevie Wonder harmony on it. It just had a lot of emotion, man. That song, that song always gets me pumped up. It's a lot of songs by Pac that I love, but that one right there is like, it's like your all -time. that's the one right there. That's makes me want to become just going to gangster mode. Yo, this is Ben Baller, and you're watching the industry on blast. <laughs>